Hey guys, today we're going to be watching David Land's Wave 7 review. Um, if I, I think I may have accidentally had to redo it, so sorry. Um, the intro, about the intro, maybe. But I'll What's just watch up, him. NASCAR Authentics fans? David Land. Click, click. Disclaimer, I do not own any of this video. So, yes, I don't own any of it. So, let's enjoy, let's watch. And here, and we are taking a look at Wave 7 of the Lionel NASCAR Authentics. Already, I know, we I just did the Wave 6 video, and now Wave 7 is here. I found these at Target. Well, I and found big it, shout out so. to Jay Logano 22 on yeah, Twitter. Yeah, that awesome. And he is probably the best source uh, for new information on NASCAR Authentics. He gave me a shout when he found these at his Target store. I went to my Target store, and there they were. So uh, a lot of credit to him uh, for getting this video out as quickly as possible. Oh, well, you know, Certainly a lot quicker than the Wave 6 video. And for those of you who uh, absolutely love these NASCAR Authentics videos, boy, are you spoiled. Uh, two waves in less than a week on my channel. So that's fantastic. For the first time Fords have been in the 2016 range of Lionel NASCAR Authentics and a new mold for those Fords. Uh, Toyotas again and a nice balance uh, balanced out with the Chevy. So all three uh, manufacturers represented in this wave, Wave 7, and I'll go out on a limb and say it's probably the best wave of NASCAR Authentic. Spoiler Kyle alert, that first. has been out so far. So I can't wait to take a look at it. Let's get into hey, it. I just wave know some, most of the cars the first car in the my uh, top So regular videos. viewers of my channel will know this car as a Jeff Gordon Exalta 88. Sure. But uh, that didn't go over too well, so I'm going to call it by its proper name. De De Dale... Dale Earnhardt Jr. Dale Earnhardt Jr.'s number 88 Exalted car. We kind of knew this car was coming. Uh, it was only a matter of time. And here it is uh, in all its glory for NASCAR Authentics. Uh, now, you guys are certainly aware that, again, the regular viewers, I have the, the uh, gold series of this car. So we'll do a little gold now, well, series. I do too. This is uh, NASCAR Authentics comparison in this video. So uh, here's a look at the back of the box. As you can see, there's all of Wave 7. I have all those cars. I accidentally the the got this car somehow. I don't know how you can uh, accidentally get this car. Hey, and I said to do the Dale the Jr. or the Kyle Busch first. Toyota so, yeah. Wait, they must Concord. not have very good lawyers over at uh, Toyota. I thought that's where so, uh, Charlotte let's take a look at the first car of the Wave at Dale Earnhardt Jr. As I proceed to choke on my own spit. That's a thing that happens sometimes when you're just so excited about NASCAR authentics. Yeah, let me know the, the link back. so we'll I can put it down. That in just a second. I literally and don't know the link. Let's take a look at I'm, Dale Jr. I'm going to put the, in the link. In the link, I'm going to put uh, um, the, ambulance the, the title. Take. But I'm going to put it in anyway because why not? Let's take a look at it. This car was too hot. So they called the police and the fireman. I told them not to, but they did anyway. So let's oh, take a closer yeah. look at this car. That part's uh, again, awesome. Like this I is, said, I already have I'm this seeing car the rest. In the Gold Series, and I'm sure a lot of people also do. <laughs> Who's ever had a rhino car that looks kind of like those old the Master the NASCAR authentics? Are a white interior versus a black interior. I have. Um, for a lot of people, I don't think that makes a gigantic difference. Uh, but it'll only be interesting to see how many people actually pick this car up as it's been available for quite a, a long time in the Gold Series. Uh, I think at least a couple months, maybe three or four. Uh, I think it may have come out in May, I want to say, and there's already a different variation of this car out in the Gold Series uh, with a little bit different logos on the, the uh, side of the car. Oh, so that reminds me. Uh, Let me tell you a story about something. So, one time I was at a Target, and... Um... I remember I had a Dale Jr. car, so I was like, Mommy, I want to get a Dale Jr. car. She said, Why? It's the same car. You have it. And I said, Because there's a different sticker on it. Yeah, I was, gosh, that, that, that story is kind of funny, but anyways, come on. Our first plastic hood in probably two waves, I think the last one we got. 
say. But pretty cool hood here. You've got Exalta 88. Shout Jr. out to David Land because nice he is awesome. Yellow, just a little tiny <clears> bit. <throat> Uh, to kind of complement this uh, oh, red this is orange color, you also have NASCAR reaction. on the back, and not a whole lot else. You get the little my light L logo reaction. there, and the place where I think someone said these they're using the Most old inner circle molds. So this is where the magnets used to go. This is how Unless, they used to do magnets apparently. If I uh, get I know, in I trouble, then I'm not going to do cars. it. So let's take a quick closer look at this car. Again, I've already reviewed really this car in the Gold Series, so it probably isn't too much to go over so we're going to do this fairly quickly um but i just want to make sure there's nothing any uh, outstanding on this car that i noticed and then we'll take a look at it next to the gold series car uh it doesn't appear so, to be anything particularly different on this car all the decals are pretty much immaculate guys what y'all don't know is that there are probably people out there so who literally have found like 10 ways and we'll zoom in but the they're not on bit. YouTube. So, that as you can see, is what's so the great. Car. Uh, looks like exactly Secret. the same color. The only real difference between the two cars that I can tell right now mm -hmm. is that the Gold Series car's Exalta logo is a little bit more wonky. Um, but that's just a detailing error. Uh, virtually identical. So if you do have the uh, the Gold Series car, uh, this is not probably one that you're going to want to pick up unless you're a very, very hardcore junior fan and you want this. Uh, but, uh, yeah, oh, yeah, I think it's a good pickup if you do not have, uh, that know, car right? yet. And, yeah, uh, I'm, I'm going to be doing what's in get, stores. Uh, scheme. I think it's a really so, good pay scheme. Yeah, it's, uh, I'm going to be doing what's in stores. Well, actually, I'm going to call it. Well, it's going to uh, be kind of nice like a NASCAR Racing Fan 2015. He's awesome, too. So go look at him, subscribe to him, and subscribe to David Lamb. Or if you've had it for months, that'll be interesting to, to find out. Uh, yes, yeah, like like his videos, David Lands, subscribe to him, and whatnot. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna be doing. Uh, the, wow, I just saw a cool looking bird. Anyways, um, what I was gonna say was that I'm gonna be doing something called NASCAR Store. Nesca Storica. I no, I'm gonna call it NASCAR Stores. What a what a lay have the show. No, I'm just gonna call it NASCAR Stores. So anyways. So let's move on like to the to next car in NASCAR fifteen two. Ah uh, yes, it's Napa's third most successful driver this I year. Can't talk. And he's running a Greg Biffle throwback. And if that didn't get you to, to dislike the video, I don't know what will. But this is Chase Elliott, three M Chevrolet from yeah, like Hendrick it. Motorsports. This is the first time we've gotten a 3M car uh, from Lionel's NASCAR Authentics. Of course, we did get a 3M car last year uh, from Spin Master. It was a Jeff Gordon, though, not a Chase Elliott. So, let's get NASCAR's new Wunderkid out and see what I'm not that the fine deal Chase is. Elliott. Well, I just like the, the car, video. but, but uh, we'll what? until Chase Elliott actually gets a win, I'm not going to be that fond of him. I think I've kind of lost hope. Kind of. So here is Chase Elliott's 3M24. Oh, and David Land, if you're watching this, I just 